National Statistics and Censuses Institute Spanish, Instituto Nacional de Estadística y Censos, INDEC is the Argentine government agency responsible for the collection and processing of statistical data. The institute also analyses economic and social indicators such as inflation rate, consumer price index and unemployment, among others. Functions. The INDEC is supervised by different federal agencies, and is under the direct oversight of the Secretaria de Programación Económica y Regional Secretariat of Economic and Regional Planning of the Ministerio de Economía y Producción Ministry of Economy and Production, MECON. The INDEC coordinates the Sistema Estadístico Nacional National Statistics System, SEN, through which the national, provincial and local statistical services work together. Each provincial government has a statistics bureau called Dirección de Estadística, that collects and processes information. The Argentine constitution does not provide for a national census. These were conducted only generationally until 1947, and roughly every decade since then. National censuses were taken in 1869, 1895, 1914, 1947, 1960, 1970, 1980, 1991, 2001, and 2010. Demographic and economic information is permanently updated with off-year censuses, such as the economic and agricultural censuses, and the sampled surveys published in Encuesta Permanente de Hogar's Permanent Survey of Households, which are delivered every six months. Monthly releases include figures on inflation, employment, trade balances, industrial production, construction, retail sales, and GDP. History The first national statistics center was the Dirección General de Estadística General Directorate of Statistics, established in 1894 as a division of the Ministry of Public Finances. Fifty years later, in 1944, the Consejo Nacional de Estadística y Censos National Council of Statistics and Censuses was created, with dependencies on both the Ministry of the Interior and the National Presidential Office. Other agencies were later formed in 1950, 1952, and 1956 before the final creation of the Instituto Nacional de Estadística y Censos in 1968 by law 17622 and decrees 3110 70 and 1831 93rds. The Bureau's headquarters are located in a downtown, rationalist building designed by Arturo Duberg, commissioned by President Juan Perón for use as the Ministry of Labor, and completed in 1956. Controversy Although nominally independent, INDEC is subject to strong political pressure from the government, and its statistics are no longer considered trustworthy. Because INDEC's statistics have been reported as being manipulated by the Kirchner government, it is considered discredited. Controversy arose when the government of President Nestor Kirchner replaced Graciela Bevacqua, the Consumer Prices Indicator Director, Indus de Precios al Consumidor, IPC. Bevacqua is reported to have arrived at a consumer price increase figure of almost 2.0% for January 2007 from internal data, but the rate officially reported to the public was 1.1%. The head of INDEC resigned in March, and a new board of directors led by Anna Maria Edwin was installed by the Ministry of Economy. The board would operate under the supervision of Commerce Secretary Guillermo Moreno. A group of employees protested publicly at what they saw as a violation of INDEC's autonomy, and an attempt by the Economy Ministry under Felisa Michelli to illegally keep inflation indicators under 1% a month. Prosecutors gathered evidence that high government officials had inquired repeatedly of statistical staff how to get lower inflation numbers, and that in early 2007 managers of the price indexes had excluded products whose prices had risen more than 15% in the survey and changed price data after it came in from the field workers. Prices and the official record have continued to part ways since former Commerce Secretary Guillermo Moreno's decision to intervene in the Statistics Institute in 2007. 
Private sector economists and statistical offices of provincial governments show inflation two to three times higher than INDEC's number which only covers Greater Buenos Aires. Unions, including those from the public sector, use these independent estimates when negotiating pay rises. Surveys by Torquato di Tella University show inflation expectations running at 25 to 30 percent. Since then, INDEC's headline inflation statistics have been substantially lower than estimates from analysts in the private sector, and also lower than INDEC's implicit private consumption price index, which is incorporated in the measurement of real GDP. Taken from the first quarter of 2007, each index from the same quarter the year before has read as follows. The discrepancy has led to exchanged accusations of politically motivated statistical ledger domain between the ruling party and most of the political opposition, on both left and right. Officials facing election have an incentive to understate the headline CPI figure. Opposition figures frequently relied on estimates made by figures such as Orlando Ferrer's a former Bunge Y born agribusiness executive and economic planning secretary for a leading opponent, former President Carlos Menem. The practice yielded the ruling party no political benefit, and helped contribute to their loss in the October 2009 mid term elections. An alternative explanation for the policy could rest on government finances. The national government has issued around $100 billion in government bonds. Payments on almost $50 billion of this are indexed to inflation. Other government bonds are tied in value to GDP growth. A seven-point underestimate in inflation could save the Central Bank of Argentina $3 billion in inflation-indexed interest payments, while higher economic growth would cost added interest on bonds tied to GDP, hence, there is a short-run financial benefit to the government from a discrepancy between the two inflation readings in the table. Since 2007, when Guillermo Moreno, the Secretary of Internal Trade, was sent into the Statistics Institute, INDEC, to tell its staff that their figures had better not show inflation shooting up, prices and the official record have parted ways. Private sector economists and statistical offices of provincial governments show inflation two to three times higher than INDEC's number which only covers Greater Buenos Aires. Unions, including those from the public sector, use these independent estimates when negotiating pay rises. Surveys by Torquato di Tella University show inflation expectations running at 25 to 30. 